Hello friends, my name is Sadiq Khan. I work with Open Minds. Here at Open Minds, we work with innovative ways of learning and teaching. Now, there are certain existing problems which have actually no solution. Right, these problems involve you, your parents and your teachers. All right? Now, we would talk about these problems one by one and how e-learning would be a concept to solve all these problems over I can talk about conventional ways of learning and teaching that is through tuitions and colleges where you have to go to a college, you gotta be there, whatever you, you like the place, you don't like the place, whatever it is, all right? We talk about a couple of uh, issues which actually have no solutions other than I can say e-learning or video classes, all right? So let's go with this. I have the first point here to say no reputation. What, what I'm talking about is the classes actually. Right, you go to a class and let's say the class is happening maybe a, a fraction of a second you just lost and maybe a couple of minutes you're not in the class mentally and just that's on right you don't understand the rest of the class right you may have to ask for a reputation class i mean you can ask the teacher right then how many times let's say every student has got this problem every five minutes then the teacher has to repeat it i mean the whole class again and again and it's not possible right so this is a problem which exists you may lose the focus for couple of minutes right then you would not the, get the whole of the class right now can you ask the teachers to repeat it back again it is not actually possible from the teachers because they may have to finish the whole portions I mean they have a limited time given to them also this is a problem right this is your problem that you need a repetitive class they cannot solve it because they have limited time right you cannot take help from your parents and your parents want you guys to study now this is a problem existing how do you solve this problem Sometimes your teachers may explain it back again a couple of times, right? That's it. Now what about maybe 100 students in the class? All of them want a repetitive class. No, it's not happening. This is the problem which doesn't have a solution. Now, e-learning or video classes is a concept where in fact you can repeat the class any number of times you need. All right, you just lost. Okay, you just missed something. Take it back. Replay it. Take the class again. Happening, right? Good. Let's go ahead. If you miss a class, let's say today's class you miss completely, you were absent to the class, can't help it, happens, right? You're absent to the class. If you go to tomorrow's class, you miss actually a huge link, you know, from day before yesterday's class to tomorrow's class. Today is important. If you're absent today, you may not understand what's happening tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, and the next classes. You need a class to build up this bridge. Now, who will take this class? Maybe you just take up the notes couple of times you make it can go personally to your teacher or you ask your friends or if you have a personal teacher yes if not then you lost the whole chapter right this is the problem now while I'm talking about e-learning video classes you don't miss a class at all because you play a class when you are when you're free there's no chance you miss a class right right let's go ahead cannot focus for long hours now what exactly is this I'm talking about see when we go to the college basically we sit from morning 9 to almost 4 o'clock in the evening or 5 o'clock in the evening now, most of the times we cannot sit and focus and it is scientifically proved that a human mind a general a common human mind cannot focus for more than one hour they need breaks right you need enough breaks conven convenient breaks long breaks now, if you don't let's say you have a small break of five minutes yes but still you have continuous classes from morning till evening can't help it right you can't focus 100 percent but this problem exists why your teachers cannot solve this problem because they have to take so many classes from morning till evening can you solve no you can't because you have to be there limited time right and you come back in the evening again you have tuition sometimes and you have you go back home by around nine o'clock ten o'clock and you can't study back again so the problem exists can your parents help no they can only send you to the college pay the fees help you sometimes that's it. Now, who will solve this problem? You want a break. You want half an hour's break. You can't really focus the time. So here is a solution. E-classes. Take a break when you want. Right? Take a break whenever you want. And when you're set to study, you have convenient mindset to study. Fine. Go ahead. That's your time. Right? Now let's go ahead. Here. We have a problem. This is a very important thing you need to know. Okay? You forget which time. This is very very evident and scientifically proved that you do forget things with time any chapter which is taken in the month of January or let's say June as uh, starting of the academic year June July August I mean they're done the first chapter now you need to write the whole 
textbook as a syllabus for your examination now who would you teach you the first chapter in the month of March the next year no you can ask your teachers to repeat or revision classes yes but can you revise everything again at the same pace as you understand no maybe you just need a couple of hours of class a particular topic but who will teach you at that time now you you will definitely in fact most of the time students do forget that's why revisions are really important who would revise your subjects maybe a break of uh, six months you need to revise a chapter who can do this you cannot ask your teachers your teachers can't solve this problem you've forgotten it you're scared you see look into your notes in your textbooks they look new at a time right can you ask your parents your parents would say yes they can help you by putting you in a tuition back again a personal tutor or they will in fact ask you back what happened in the college why didn't you study what happened in the tuitions? You're going to the best tuitions. What happened? Now, the problem exists. Though you have very good teachers, though you're a very good student, you understood the topic at that particular time, you tend to forget things after some time. This is there in humans. Now, who can solve this problem? Again, we can say video classes, a class which you can play whenever you want. Okay, fine. After six months, you need the class just play it. You have it. This is luxury for you, right? Yeah. You forget the subject, you play it back. That's what the answer is. Let's go ahead. This is one of the things very personal. I mean, I, I don't think so. Anyone understand this, uh, being your parents or a teacher. Sometimes, you would not disclose your personal moods, your personal emotional disturbances to your teachers or your parents. They would rather give you a lecture about it. And I, you, you don't have to be into all this mess at this age. But who can avoid your mood swings, right? You have a problem. You fought with your friend. Let's say. You can't go and tell your teacher, I fought my friend. I'm not in a good mood to study today. That would be a terrible scene. I mean, you would be blasted for this. Now, eventually, but you would be sitting in the class and you don't understand. You can't help it. I mean, humans, right? And if you bunk the class, again, you come back to the first point, right? The whole thing is this. That time, whatever happening to the rest of the world is their job. It's a job of the teacher to finish the class. You are in a good mood, you're in a bad mood, or whatever mood you are. You take this problem to your parents and say, I'm not in a good mood today for a couple of days. I don't want to study. I mean, they would just blast you or they would tell them, and you, you're supposed to work at this age or your age. Being kids, you should not be having problems, but you have problems. Who will solve this thing? I can say, yes, video classes. You're not in the mood, shut down the class. Shut in the class, you miss the class in the college, fine, it's okay. You come back home, two, three days, take your time, put yourself back into mood. You learn things, right, that you have a class. That's about it. Very important thing to know. Let's say, we talk about, uh, the next point here is talk about a lot of time and money spent for tuitions. I mean, this is a serious concern. Sometimes you have tuitions pretty far, you need to travel in buses. Sometimes it takes around two hours of your time. Very valuable time of second PUC very valuable time right you spend this on buses on auto rickshaws on, on your vehicles in traffic stuck in the traffic of the whole days of your classes that takes your time and also takes your money right so every day minimum of let's say 30 rupees or 20 rupees is what you spend on travel just to reach your tuitions and come back right and you spend at least one hour minimum one hour sometimes two hours very expensive time right so can you avoid this? You can't because you have to go to the classes. Who can solve this problem? You, your teachers, your parents, your tuition teachers, anyone? No. Oh, yes, there is one solution that is e-classes here. Learn from your home. Sit at home. You go back home. You're tired after 5 o'clock in the evening because you are in the classes in your college. You're tired. I mean, immediately going back to tuitions again, focusing is hard, right? So you go back home, take a nap, relax sleep sometime get up again start eight o'clock right eight o'clock to twelve o'clock good time you're fresh again things are easier at that time because you can focus you're fine right so continue the class from nine in the morning to five again take a break travel again go back to the tuitions again study and go back home in the night and what expected you can you work at home no just because you are continuously working from morning till evening it is not possible with e-classes, with video classes, finish your college, go back home, relax, sleep, get up in the, at 8 o'clock in the evening. Who teacher will come at 8 to 12 in the night? No one. But still you have a choice. E-classes will help you this, right? Let's talk about the last, 
not the least, but there are so many advantages of e-classes. We cannot mention it. Let's ta just talk about the major issues. The last one here I say is, cannot catch up with the pace of teaching in the class. Yes, I can say every student in the class will not have the same mindset or the same speed of understanding the subject. Some of them are slow, right? Some students are pretty fast. Now, sometimes teachers would teach those first, first benchers, you know, who understand, who answer back. Yes, they go along with the pace. People who are sitting in the last bench sometimes you're not interested because you don't understand the pace. They're too fast and you can't hold the class. You cannot stop them. You cannot ask them to go slow. I mean, because they can't solve it themselves. They need to finish that much of portions in that much of time. Very limited time given to teachers also. Who is supposed to solve this problem? That is the whole idea. Now, you cannot catch up. You say, oh, okay, it's not happening. Cut it down. You go back home, you go back to tuitions, again tuitions have the same pace, not happening. So finally you start believing that you, you're not fit for science, you, you're fit, not fit for second PUC, mathematics is too difficult, I can't understand. Just because you didn't have the right pace, there was no one to tell you when you wanted to study and how you want to study at your own pace, yes, that was the problem. Now, can we solve this problem? Can you solve this problem? See, all the problems, all these problems we spoke about today in this session, is all existing, right? These problems are supposed to be of teachers because they cannot solve this, but they are involved. They are, in, they are involved in teaching because you are involved in learning. Can your parents solve this? No, not happening. And can you solve this? The only possible way of solving this is e-classes. That's it. Now, the next thing, what everyone asks me, right? Let's say parents or teachers and students as you guys, is, is it possible to learn any subjects through video classes? Now, I need to first convince you guys, yes, it's possible. So once you know that it's possible, yes, go ahead. Right, for that, I just cannot talk, right? You just listen to me what I just now, I said now, and you say, yes, it's possible. No, it's not like that. Let me teach you one full chapter of your second POC syllabus, that is differentiation, supposed to be one of the most difficult chapters. I will teach you the whole complete chapter, all right? It, in this video class, in the next, uh, the application what we have built at Open Minds for you guys. If I can teach you differentiation through video classes, then there is a solution for all these problems, and you, the one who would be benefited, right? This is a luxury. You need to have this. Whether you're going to tuitions, whether you're not going to tuitions, this is the product which will help you, which will be your friend, your personal tutor at your time, your convenient time. So I suggest you guys strongly that watch this whole class once. Whether you know differentiation, you don't know it, just watch it and see if at all you can. The rest of the syllabus, the whole mathematics of second POC would become really easy for you. All right, let's go ahead and see how we can learn through the video classes the new concept of e-learning, alright?